on everybody, it's Ace Train and Ninja here to date my dudes for a brand new episode of a Pokemon Diamond Randomized Type Lock. Back after a week, hopefully you guys are excited and st we're still excited for this series. I know Pokemon Let's Go dropped last week. I know that everyone's so excited about that. Or maybe a week before last. Week before last. Anyway, it's been out for a week now. I know everyone's super excited about it. Everyone's been loving it a lot. And I don't have any way of recording it and sharing it with you guys. And I don't have any way of even playing it because I don't even have a Switch. <laughs> So I can buy a switch. Anyway, <laughs> I'm mostly joking. <laughs> um, anyway, hopefully you guys are excited for today's episode. If you are, make sure you drop a like for me down below. It really does help out a lot. Subscribe if you are new around here and share this video with a friend. But let's do real quick a team recap. First off, we have Chloe, the Altaria, who we had to pick up. Uh, well, I think we did some. We did a lot of grinding, as you guys just saw. Um, so I'm trying to remember because it's been a week since I actually did the grinding. Uh, I, I know we lost Lapras in the last episode. By the way, if you missed the last episode, check it out. Link right here in an eye card, as well as link in the description to the playlist of the series. But, um, we lost Lapras in the last episode. And I think I switched out a team member in grinding, plus the egg hatched. Uh, and we, that guy got switched out because it was just a little Mr. Mime. We'll sh I'll show it to you guys later uh, in this in this episode. Hopefully, I'll remember to do that. Uh, but anyway, first off, we have Altar Chloe the Altaria, level 21, with a Life Orb, Mild Nature, Natural Cure Ability, Rock of the Moves, Astonish, Sing, Ice Fang, and Safeguard. Next up, we have Vignish the Sand Slash, level 26, with a Razor Fang, uh, Gentle Nature, Sand Veil Ability, Rock of the Moves, Crush Claw, Roll Out, Poison Sing, and Sand Attack. Next up, we have Dario, the him on top of level 29. I try to get the entire team 29, but these two kind of uh, fell behind. I think I might give Chloe the XP share and put her in the back for now. Maybe. That's something I'm, I'm racking around in my brain right now. Anyway, we have Dario, the him, him on. <laughs> Words. Uh, Dario, the him on top of level 29 with a Shell Bell, Rash Nature, Intimidate Ability, Rock of the Moves, Triple Kick, Rock Smash, Counter, and Quick Attack. Next up, we have Great Wall the Bastion on level 28, the Leftovers, uh, Brave Nature, Sturdy Ability, Rock the Moves, Metal Claw, Take Down, Ancient Power, and Protect. Next up, we have a Dario. Dario? What? Dario. Dario's hit on top base. Calm down. Uh, next up, we have Metro, the Token Take at level 28, with the Amulet Coin, Modest Nature, Serene Grace Ability, Rock the Moves, Facade, Wish, Power Jam, and Yawn. Next up, we have Bad Words, the Sceptile level 28 with the Metal Plate, Bold Nature, Overgrow Ability, Rock the Moves, Absorb, Exit to Pursuit, and Quick Attack. And that is the team moving forward. So I think we're going to put Chloe in the back for now. Vignish could possibly help out, uh, given the proper situation, uh, but doesn't have any stab moves yet, and that makes me really sad. So we're just going to lead off with Sceptile. Hope for the best. We are getting a gym badge today, hopefully. So, uh, say your prayers. Hello, I'm pleased, to, I'm pleased to meet you. I'm Maylene. I, and I'm the gym leader. Hmm. I don't really know what it means to be strong or how I got to be the gym leader. But I will do my best. I, can, I will do the best I can as the gym leader. It's been a week since I've done this stuff. I apologize, dude. It's going to be rusty. I'm going to be, I'm going to be a little bit trippy over my words, man. Apologies right now. Buckle in. It's going to be a very confusing ride. <laughs> I take battling very seriously. Whenever you're ready. I guess I'm ready. Versus Maylene, who is actually known as Cool Trainer Female Jill. With a Cyndaquil. Jill with Cyndaquil. Hashtag bars. Level 30, okay. See, I, I knew the grinding was necessary. I knew the grinding was necessary, but he only does, he does only have three mons, and his first, her first one's a Cyndaquil. So he might have been pretty okay to just come in do this last episode but oh well it's fine he's fine and yes I know that I am a part steel type but I'm also part rock and I eat that up pretty well look at that nice HP recovery as well and I'm gonna follow up with a nice little ancient power on this little Cinta Quill's face this was my plans all along I've just noticed well, I didn't just notice but I'm just gonna point it out to you because and pretend like I just noticed I look like a grandpa or an old man in this hat and I'm not sure if I dig that or if I don't, but I know you guys are kind of down with the hat. I like the hat. It's a fun hat. It's interesting. It's different. Yeah. 
Yeah, fun fact for you. Fun fact for you. All right, Cynical use a Swift. That's doing literally nothing, and I'm gonna pop. I'm gonna bop you right now with this ancient power, okay? And watch me get the boost. Watch me get the boost. Watch me get the boost. No boost. No boost. JK, I was pulling your chain. Yanking, yanking your toes, man. I don't know. Do people say that? I don't know. 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 I I don't know. I don't know. I don't I can put you to sleep with Metro. Or I could try to poison you with Poison Sting. I can put you to sleep with Chloe. I think I'm gonna go for the Poison Sting. I'm gonna go for the Poison Sting, because it shouldn't do that much damage, and we're just not gonna do much damage in return. And I'm just gonna spam it until I get a poison. That's my plan. I'm literally just gonna spam Poison Sting until I get a poison. There we go. Sick. Didn't take that long. Sick, bruh. Okay. So now I'm going to keep spamming it because it's doing very little damage. And I don't really have to worry about counter damage. Andy's going to slowly die to the poison. I feel like if I went for Crush Claw and did big damage, he would he would then instantly go and counter me. And I don't want that happening. Even though he's spamming Miracle right now and not using counter on this physical attack. Clearly, you are the greatest Wobbuffet trainer in the world. I really wish I had Let's Go, man. I really, really wish I had Let's Go. I've been watching Shady Penguin play it, and it looks so fun. I, honestly, when I saw the trailers and I heard the game announcements and all that stuff, I thought, wow, another Gen 1 remake. Wow. <laughs> not like I've ever played Gen 1 before. You know, I was not excited about it at all. I, like, literally at all. I, I, I had no excitement level at all about the game, but... Now that it's out and I've seen gameplay of it, I really want to play it. It looks really cool. Awesome. Awesome. The Hyper Potion plays are real. Um, I could go for Crush Claw, but I'm really afraid. I'm really afraid of damage. I'm really afraid of the damage. We're just, we're just going to spam it, man. We're just going to we're gonna go for the spam, okay? We're going to sit here and have, have a conversation while we're spamming Poison Sting. How are you guys doing today? Let me know in the comments if you guys are having a good day, a bad day, a meh day, you know. I want to know. I want to know. I really do. Also, fun fact for you guys. For you guys who watch these videos, you guys care. I'm going to try my darndest to get back on a regular recording schedule, okay? Um, a lot of you know that I've been getting into the habit of not recording when I don't feel like recording. That way I don't make bad content. Because bad content is not good, right? No content's better than bad content. So I've been really trying to get into the habit of just not recording when I don't feel like it, but I also want to get into the habit of recording more than one video when I do feel like it. Also, while I finally went down, but um, I really want to get into the habit of, of just having extra videos recorded so when I don't feel like recording, I don't have to record. Now, something that I'll try to figure out, I'll try to figure out scheduling and stuff because recording more than one episode of Diamond could be troublesome because if I do feel like recording tomorrow then I can't record anything because I already have a video done. Well, I guess I could record the next well then I just get really ahead of myself and I wouldn't be able to keep up with the comment section. Anyway, I'll figure it out obviously. But yes, I'm going to try to get more than one video done a day when I do feel like recording. Like today I'm going to try to record one episode of this. I'm going to try to record an episode of Crystal because we kind of forgot about that series. Um, I'm going to try to bring it back. And I'm going to try to get um, like a something else done you know I don't, I don't know maybe a Wi-Fi battle video maybe um I don't know what else do we do in the channel I don't know I'll figure something out you know I'm gonna try to get more than one video done uh, as well as get all my stuff I need to do for the day you know so yeah that's exciting right that's cool also we're not losing bad words right now hex to the no not to an espion anything but an espion he must the quick attack man he, he almost he almost super read my play. I almost went for quick attack so I can outspeed him. Oh, good thing I didn't. <laughs> Espeon goes down to the X scissor from Bad Words. Bad Words out here doing all the work. <laughs> I shall admit defeat. You are much too strong. Darn right, girl. Gym badge. Sick, bro. That was like <laughs> I made my own sound effect for that too. 
professional quitting. You know, I'm a professional content creator. Okay, you win. Mm. That was a tough loss. I learned a lot from it. Please accept this gym badge. Now it's on the layout. Because I forgot to wait for the music to play. Because I always do that. Now, now I'm going to look like I'm a loser, man. Not a professional anymore. Uh, hmm. I should explain about that badge. If you have that official Pokemon League badge, you can use the hidden move fly outside of battle. Oh, and please take this as well. TM60. TM60. Contains the move Bolt Tackle. Yeah, it usually, I think it usually has Force Palm or something, but, uh, does it, what does it normally have? Is it, is it Force Palm? It might be Force Palm, but I don't think so. Or Sphere, maybe? Maybe it's Or Sphere. I don't know. Anyway, it's normally a good fighting move. Hmm. Hmm. That move inflicts damage, and it robs the HP star. Oh, it's, it's, it's Drain Punch. It's Drain Punch. I told you, it's a good, it's a good fighting move. Okay, so we got Bolt Tackle now. Team 60 Volt Tackle. So we can actually teach no one Volt Tackle. Never mind. I was gonna say, I think Dario can learn Volt Tackle, but I guess he doesn't learn Drain Punch. Darn, Bad Words can learn Volt Tackle, but we're not gonna do that. Sick, dude. Gym badge. Ready ready on the layout, man. Looking good. Looking fresh. Looking clean. Now we got things to do. Hey, Dawn. How you doing, man? You didn't possibly lose your Pokedex, did you? <laughs> Hi, Jace. Uh, please, can you help me? I dropped my Pokedex by accident and Team Galactic found it. Now they won't give it back. Please, I need your help. I'll be waiting in front of the warehouse. Please come. I got you, girl. I got you, girl. All right. Looking like we're heading to the warehouse. Let's get a quick heal up first, though, because my eye's itchy and looking a little twitchy, and don't judge me. My allergies, for some reason, decide that they want to kick in in the middle of recording. They do that a lot. It's super annoying. Thank you, allergies. Ugh. Ugh, 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 ugh. Don't let me forget to take medicine before I record next time, okay? Leave a comment down below being like, Ace, Ace, listen to me. Listen to me. Take your medicine. Take your fucking medicine. <laughs> you know what? Even if you, if you did do that, I would probably give it a big heart and a big heart. Uh, what is it? Like a super like or whatever? I don't know. I think it's a Tinder thing. <laughs> I wouldn't know that. I don't use I don't use dating apps. Um. Anyway, moving along. Awkward. <laughs> Hi, Jace. Can you please help me? I shot my Pokedex by accident. And Team Galactic found it. Now they won't give it back. Please, I need your help. You want to team, team up and battle with me? <clears throat> sure. You and your Pokemon together with my me and my Pokemon united like this. I dream team has no chance of losing. I'm not letting those bad. I'm not letting these bad people get away with their dirty deeds. Done dirt cheap. <laughs> director Marilyn and Director Noel Lay. Noel Lay. With a knocked out and a what? A Dawn fan. Interesting combination. So we got Furt and Bad Words out here. Alright, so I'm feeling a little bit nervous. Feeling a little bit nervous of that knocked owl. Just a tad. But I do want to go for the absorb on the Dawn fan. Because I feel like it's going to do decent damage. It's a special attack. My special attack's not fantastic and it's just absorb, but I think it's decent damage. It's decent damage. We see, we see slam on knocked owl. Good move. Confusion, I can eat that up pretty good. And a magnitude 6. Not doing any damage to his fellow Knocked Owl. Okay, or his fellow teammate, his Knocked Owl. Looking like pro strats over here, like, like they planned this. Alright. I'm gonna go for another Absorb. Because I can get my HP back. Bird's going for the Helping Hand to boost my Absorb, hopefully. The thing is, I think I'm pretty sure that's how that works, right? Helping Hand, that's how that works, isn't it? I've never used Helping Hand. I'm not, I don't do like VGC or whatever. I don't do team based moves. That's definitely boosted damage. That's definitely boosted damage. That's how that's how it works, isn't it? It boosts the damage of the move your teammate uses. Wow, I eat up the packs, bro. I eat those for breakfast. My guy. Jeez, bad words. Just eating up everything over here. 
eating up everything over here. Okay, so... I guess I'm gonna go... Uh, X scissor. I guess I'm gonna go for a quick attack on Knocked Owl, real quick. Try to get that boosted damage off. On this Knocked Owl, right now, getting big damage. Never mind. Like, medium well damage. Magnitude 6 doesn't do anything, but I die to another peck. I do die to another peck. So let me just swap out here. To... Chloe. To finish these guys off, I guess. Get a helping hand on the swap, bro. He gave, he gave me a big clapping. Give me a clap when I swapped in, man. He's, he's a very supportive teammate. Very, very, very supportive teammate. Ferret died. Ferret is now deceased. Ferret is gone. Chloe, Chloe is unaffected. He has like Kingler. You couldn't have brought that in 10 minutes ago and done big work to this Dawn fan? Oh, now you're gonna go for the bubble. Okay, cool. Cool, bro. Cool, bro. Cool, bro. I see. I see what you're going for. Look, now you get the kill. You stole my kill, man. I needed both of these limbs to win the game. Please. <laughs> Please don't do this to me. Oh my gosh, dude. Oh my god. My eye is so itchy, dude. My eye is so itchy, dude. What am I learning? Leaf Blade. Sick, bro. I'll oh, get absorbed, dude, right now. If we get absorbed right now. Sick, dude. Leaf Blade. I'll freaking take it. Chloe getting a nice level 22 off of that. And we see Reflect boosting the team's defense, but does it matter on the Ice Fang? I don't think it does. It does matter. Sick, bro. Sick, bro. Mantine. All right. All right. Bringing out the, the, the derp guns. Okay. Bringing out the derp guns. I'm just going to go for another Ice Fang. Never mind. He's going to steal that kill, too. Dude. Dude, dude, what are you doing, man? Why, why you do this to me, man? Come on, man! Why you do this to me? All right, Ice Spring's not doing anything to you. Nice and neutral, no stab, barely doing anything. Blaze again, okay? You best bubble that blaze again. You had best bubble that blaze again. And what do I do to the Mantine? Like, what do I do to the math time? I'm gonna go for a safeguard. How about the team a little bit? I'm gonna go for a safeguard. Okay, we see the bubble in the place again. How much is that gonna do? My eye is super itchy, dude. It's so annoying, dude. Oh my god! Stop it! Just stop it, please. I went outside for like two minutes. Calm down. Calm down. 20 points isn't enough. Never mind. Um, 200 is too much. 50 is probably about right. Water pulse on the, water pulse on the Kingler. Interesting technique, Vantine. I I don't know what you're going for there. See another peck on Chloe. See another bubble beam. See another bubble beam. Okay. So now I'm gonna go for the Astonish of the Mantine. Try to get damage on that thing. Mudshot KO. Interesting. Interesting. Jesus, dude, that's doing nothing. Okay, that reflect finally wore off. Sick. Sick. That, I forgot that that was up. That's why I was doing so little damage. That's why I was doing so little damage. Of course, it only halves it, so I'm not doing much more than that anyway, but still. That's why I was doing so little damage. Metal Claw. That's resisted, bro. Oh, but you get the attack boost. Okay, I see what you're going for there. I see what you were going for there. I'm gonna sing this thing. That's annoying me. He stole all the kills. 
He stole all the kills. You were the worst teammate. Learning mist? I don't need to learn mist. I'm good. I'm good, man. I feel like good with what I have right now. That's fine. It's fine. I can't think of a time that I've ever used mist anyway, so. Oh, that stinks. Our Pokemon are champs. We should get new ones from headquarters. Hm. Who cares about some Pokedex anyway? Team Galactic's going to own the world of own all the Pokemon in the world. No, in the universe. There, take it. Take your Pokedex. Those two things we have in the where those things we have in the warehouse. Those things we had in the warehouse of already had I've already been moved to Pastoria City anyway. Okay, I, that didn't make sense in my head. Okay, I'm sorry. Okay, so we'll say you'll get yours and run like the grunts we are. What's going on? Why is Team Galactic out in the streets like they own the place? Jace, thank you sincerely. If Professor Rowan ever finds out that I lost my Pokédex, I don't want to think about it. So Chase, what are you going to do now? I'm thinking of going to Pastora City now. The Great Marsh there is home to all to many kinds of Pokemon. So she mentions she mentions Pastoria City, Pastora. I don't think I've ever actually pronounced that city's name right. Actually, even though these are my favorite games ever, I don't think I've ever pronounced the name of that city right. Pastoria, Pastora. I don't know. Anyway, it looks like we're going there next, so that's cool. We're gonna mosey on down the route right now and head on that direction. And then I'm gonna go get some I'm some medicine for my allergies and hopefully record another video once my allergy medicine kicks in in about 20, 30 minutes. Pro planning. Okay. <laughs> moving along, moving along, heading on, heading on south, heading on down, down to the riverbed, man. Heading on down to the Paradise City where the grass is green and the girls are pretty right now. Hello, how are you? Are you going to take Route 204? You're serious, aren't you? It's too badly chewed up and there's nothing to see there. Well, I guess there is that Ruin Maniac guy that, could, that you could check out. That guy's been digging his way through the bedrock all by himself. My, oh my. Don't have to go collect unknowns for him to finish that take cave. I'll never finish that game because I don't know where the heck we're gonna collect unknowns from. Look out behind you! What is it? It's nothing. It's literally, literally nothing. I keep getting notifications on my phone. <laughs> Alright, bad words. You got a dragon there in front of you? That's fine, man. We've done we felt we've we felt up worse. Now, wait, what? We've done we've dealt with worse. What the heck sentence did I just spit out of my mouth? <laughs> um, we're not gonna talk about it. Uh, <laughs> what do we go into here? Um, like I don't really have anything that's doing crazy good damage to this thing. It's resisted. So it does a fair chunk, but it's resistant. Can I get another one off? Sick, bro. It's got no HP left. I just went I went for the wrong move. With the wrong move. Oh well. It works, apparently. We broke through the paralysis again. I didn't see what you were going into because I was speeding up like a dingus. Going to Dario. Got a nice intimidate. Literally the most useful swap in I could have picked. It's the best. <laughs> All right, uh, who are we going to then? Who are we going to then? Bad words of this pursuit could be nice. Great Wall has the ancient power. He is the ancient of powers on the team. Okay. Nice and curse. Nice and curse. Nice and curse. I see you. Nice and curse. Trying to get that. Trying to get that residual damage off. I see you. Curse plus the will o wisp. This man's going for the kill in about five minutes. 
And he knows that I'm a wall and he needs to whittle me down, man. He knows. He's a pro player. He's a pro freaking player. Look at all the damage he's doing. Ivysaur, okay. Uh, 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 uh. Who do I go into? Uh, holy Ivysaur. Let's go to Metro. Ah, my face is running liquids from everywhere. It's the best. All right, facade. How much is facade doing? Let's go for the facade, man. Right now, facade. Big damage. Medium, medium, medium damage. Medium well damage. Let's go for another one. All right, let's we'll go for three facades, man. Let's we'll go for three facades, man. This is fine, man. We'll just knock them out in three facades. It's all good, man. My nose is so runny. It's so annoying. I'm sorry I keep wiping in front of you, too. I don't want to wipe it on my shirt. I don't have any. I, I should really just get like tissues to keep here at the table, here at the, here at the desk. That would make sense, wouldn't it? Like I have a spot right there that'd fit fine. They would look. They'd look fine. They'd be behind the monitor. I could reach behind there, get a tissue, maybe turn the face cam off for a second, blow my nose, whatever. You know, it'd be it'd be Gucci, man. It'd be great. But no, I'm not that smart. Also, I have look at all this stuff I have here now, man. I'm I'm like looking at it in the camera. It looks like it's so much more than it actually is. Also, I found uh, a whole lot of my old Pokemon stuffed animals that are not up there. So there's more, okay, and there's more. Everyone calls me the Ruin Maniac. I don't care what they call me. I'll keep on chipping away at the rock wall, little by little. You know why? I'm a Ruin Maniac who is fascinated by the unknown. I know it's a little sudden, but how about we have a race? You go and catch the unknown, and I'll keep digging away. We'll have a race to see who can get done faster. We're gonna go ahead and, and not do that. Team for jump kick. Can I find anything in here though? I feel like, I feel like I can, but I don't know. All right, Ruin, Ruin Maniac Cave. Let's see if I can find something in here. I can get an encounter in Route 2, 214 as well. We haven't done that yet. There is an encounter in here, okay. Do we have a bug? I don't know we have a bug. I don't think we have a bug, and that could be literally one of the best bugs we could have gotten. That's literally one of the best bugs we could have gotten. It's so good in this generation. He's just he's boosting up with the fence odors. He's gonna go to sleep here in a minute. I'm going for the facade. He's asleep. I'm gonna whittle him down with the facade while he's sleeping and then go for another yawn. I don't think he has anything that can wake that he can kill himself with. Alright, go for another yawn. Ugh. Okay. Multi turn moves are annoying. Do not crit him. Ow! Big yikes, bro. Oh my gosh, great walls burned. Okay, cool. Dario, get out of here. Okay. Pokeball. Pokeball, 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 Pokeball. Best for water and bug types. Let's get it, bruh! Get that netball! Get that Vesper Quinn! Yay. Yay. I'm a little happy dance. <laughs> I'm, I'm excited, dude. I like, I like Vesper Quinn. I've never used him in a Gen 4 playthrough. I'm excited. Its adamant is a huge honeycomb for grubs. It raises its grubs on honey collected by combi. Grubs. I think grubs are like grub worms. Little little babies. Okay, wait, we need we need a nickname for this guy. We need a nickname for this guy. Whoa. I was not ready. Okay, yeah, sure. Game. Sure phone. Don't listen to my first click and just start playing an ad that I didn't want to watch. That's awesome. Okay. Ooh, um 
um, 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 notifications, um, 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 um. And we have... Nicknamed. I think we have nicknames after everyone here so far. <laughs> um... We do, man. We've nicknamed everyone at... I think they have phone here so far. Uh, I think there's one here that we may not have, but I'm not sure. I'm not sure, and it's not a female name. Darn it, bro. Okay, uh, female names. Female names. Um, we go for the most unoriginal nickname ever for Vesper Queen. Ready for this? Uh, most unoriginal name for Vesper Quinn. <laughs> Queen Bee. Queen Bee! The Vesper Quinn. Sick, bro. Alright. Alright, man. We're looking good. We're looking good. Also, I don't want to cuck you guys because we do have what we only have one more encounter to get, and they're right here. So we're gonna go for a little bit of a longer episode today. Let's get this. Let's get this route 204 encounter. 214 encounter. I don't know if we have a ghost type slash dark type. But I'm gonna catch you. And then we'll have to run back to the box and see what we have. Cause I really do not know. He detected on me, bro. He detected my shenanigans. Okay. Go to sleep. Go to sleep. Alright. He woke up. I need you to not be woke up. I need you to go ahead and not be woke, please. Go back to sleep. Go back to sleep. It's a good save lie. Have a nice nap. Alright. Let's get this. Let's get this great ball. And go for the capture. First try, two times. I'm 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 a master man. I'm a Pokemon's master. Hey, wait, oh wait, we still don't have a nickname for this thing. Sick, bro. All right. Um. Huh. Oh, I think I have a good nickname for it. If it's a female, I have a good nickname for it. If it's a female, I have a good nickname for it. Please be a female or genderless. It's a male. Darn it. As a male, okay. Uh, oh, I really wanted to name it Jade, but yeah, it's gonna be a really weird, like, wide nickname, but uh. Tyler. Literally no reason <laughs> to name it. To name this little little dude Tyler. All right, sick, bro. Let's go check these guys out before we wrap up the episode. A little bit of a longer episode, but that's fine. A lot longer of an episode, actually. It's gonna be after after the grinding montage. We're probably gonna be sitting at around 40 minutes, dude. A little bit wild. Longer episode though. I mean, it's been a week since we had a video though, so it's fine. You guys are gonna be cool with that, right? Let's check these kids out. Let's check these kids out. All right, let's go to Bebe's box. Check them out. Make sure we don't have duplicates. Okay, so we do it. We do it. I forgot about Mary. He's a ghost type. So are you primary dark or primary ghost? You're primary dark. So Ty Tyler's staying. Queen Bee's good. 
Oh, here was another problem with this. I nicknamed this thing Redstone and then went to the box to put him down and I remembered we had Elite right here. So, that's a little bit of a, of a problem. So this, this is the mom we got from our egg. Okay, this is the mom we got from our egg. So here's a question for you guys that I wanted to ask. Do we, since we can't, we can't decide if we're gonna catch this or not. Uh, it's given to us, attached, we have no control over what it is. Um, do we just accept that it's a duplicate psychic type and keep it since it was an, it was given to us? Or is it a duplicate psychic type and we get rid of it? It's up to you guys. Honestly, I don't know if they're ever, I don't know if either of these psychic types are ever even gonna hit the team. But these are our psychic types, and I want you to decide if Mime Jr. gets to stay because it was an egg, or if it gets if it gets released because it's a duplicate psychic type. I want you guys to decide which one would be best. Which would be best for the for the for the lock? Which would make more sense? All right, Queen B, the best McQueen. Naughty nature, not bad. Pressure with defend, odor, pursuit, fury swipes, power gem. I dig it. And we got Tyler, who has quiet nature, stall ability. The move <laughs> moves after. Uh, even slower foes. Okay, cool. So guaranteed going last literally useless ability terrible ability actually uh, with astonish fury swipes fake out and detect Interesting move set Terrible terrible ability, but this is our dark type Not terrible. I mean Tyler's pretty terrible with, with just just because of the ability if it wasn't for the ability He'd be good. I like him. He would be he might even make a team member, you know a good team member someday Queen B though I'm feeling like could make a very good team member is there if there was anyone we wanted to get rid of though I don't know if we have anyone we want to get rid of. I like the team right now. It's not perfect It could be better You know Metro and Chloe kind of rock the same general you know, usefulness, you know, they kind of do the same thing. But, um, Metro's normal and flying, and we got Dragon and flying. So as soon as Chloe gets a Dragon type move, she'll be able to do her own thing. But right now, they kind of both are just kind of come in, put something to sleep, and catch it. That's kind of what they do right now. Um, I don't know, man. I don't know, man. I mean, what would be the usefulness of putting a bug on the team over Metro? If we ever get a Dawnstone, Metro is coming back, 100%. Man, we'll get that Togetic and rock it out. But is there something that's better about Queen Bee that we should swap them out? Other, other than a new stab. I, I really I really I really think it's actually a really good idea. The new stab could be really really nice. A new stab could be really really nice. Cause normal's not that useful of a stab typing. It's really not. But we'll have to remember the metro's in there. And we will 100 percent scoop her back up when it comes time for um, evolution. I'm gonna give the XP share to Queen B right now. I'm gonna give him the XP, give her the XP share. Go for a quick heal up because our entire team is looking a little bit sad. A little bit, but a, a little bit of a problem today. Got paralysis and burn, low HP across the board. Not looking too good, but now they're a lot better. Sick, bro. All right, and I'm gonna wrap up here. Because what, what better place to wrap up an episode than in a Pokemon Center? So hopefully you guys enjoyed today's video. If you did, make sure you drop a like for me down below. It really, really does help out a lot. Especially if you made it to the end of the video. That means you enjoyed it at least a little bit. So hit that like button. Subscribe if you are new around here. And share this video with a friend. At least one of them. I would greatly appreciate it. Help get that subscriber number up. Help get these view counts up. Help get my interest level <laughs> in making sure we get consistent content. Again, back up. I love you guys. I'll see you guys all in the next video. Peace.